Coming up next, it's a lightweight bout between Nate Diaz and Eddie Alvarez. Our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. Diaz is 30. Alvarez is 32. Diaz will have a 7-inch reach advantage. And with the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a freestyle fighter, holding a professional record of 28 wins. Nate Diaz, Eddie ready. Alvarez. You ready? And go, here on. we go. Interesting matchup here, Joe. Will they try to go for the submission, or will they choose to stand and strike? Joe, you know, another thing that's entertaining when you speak of Nate Diaz is he's got good boxing skills, and he likes to showcase those skills every time he steps into the octagon. Yeah, he does have good hands, utilizes his reach well, and he's got a great personality. One of the most entertaining fighters, loves to talk trash both before and during the fight. Man, Joe, it's going according to game plan here. Defend and counter. Very nice timing with these shots here. Tagged him. That's a nice leg kick right there. Both men came out hard. Good job blocking the punch. Alvarez with the nice straight to the bottom. Good. Good shots here. That head kick hurt him. Joe once again looking for those counter strikes. And he parries that. Here it is again. Just over three now. Huge oh, slam. slam! Under three on the clock, round one. Half guard. He's got the full mount, Joe. Able to posture up. his eyes looking really swollen. You've got to wonder whether or not it's actually a fractured orbit. Oh, he scores with a left. huge left. Alvarez gets back to side control. Big elbow. Smash. He's looking to keep busy on the ground. Alvarez is unable to pass. Nicely done, reversal. Now able to posture up. Right to half guard. 30 seconds. Joey's trying to pass into half guard. Alvarez with an elbow from the bottom. He is doing some damage with these elbows. And now he's back in full guard. And that'll be the end of round number one. And here we go. Let's take a look at some of this action here. Here's a nasty ground and heavy damage by ground and pound in that round. Round two. Good defense with the parry. Nice jab by Diaz. Hit him wow. hard with that hook. Big straight punch. Over the top. Big shots. Head kick. Good combination.
she's landing here. Oh, that's a big straight right. Nick Diaz is not effectively using his reach advantage tonight. He's certainly not using that reach advantage. What he's doing is fighting like a guy who's much shorter than he actually is. He's got the clinch. He's got over under. He's got full control here, double underhooks. Pummels out of double underhooks here. He set that up nicely for the hip toss. Half guard. Moves to full guard. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Midway point of the fight. That bruise on his torso is getting much worse. Just over two on the clock. Trying to take the back here. Both hooks in. Half guard. Alvarez is keeping busy from his half guard. He's posturing up here. In half guard. He moves to stacking him now. Joe, he's showcasing some great movement on the ground. One minute. He's got side control. In half guard position. He's shot with the left. left. He's in half guard. Let's see what he can do from here. Hip escape. Gets out of the full mount. Beautiful body shot there, too. Oh, in reverse. Wow! They are on their feet! And here's a nice punch that lands clean. And here's another punch that sneaks through. Amazing highlights from that round. Ground control. You're really showing the judges that you're in charge. Next time we get it down to the ground, I want you to start looking for submissions. Your submission game... Ariani getting a set for round number three. Here we go, let's go. Are you ready? Are you ready? Let's Five go, minutes go. left in the fight. Who's going to win this round? Comes out swinging. And a right behind it. Joe, that cut keeps getting worse, and it looks nasty. He's really mixing things up to me. Oh, that's a big straight. Nice kick to the body by Diaz. Alvarez with the overhand left. Look at that. He avoids damage again. Right to the liver of his opponent. He's trying to stay up. He is in big, big trouble. ground and pound. Good work on the ground. Hard shots to the body being landed on the ground. Good job from the top by Alvarez. And more ground and pound. He's got a half guard here. In the full mount. Posturing up. Alvarez with the solid right. 
Oh, oh big right, right hand. That right hand. Big shot. That's it. That's it. TKO. It was some brutal ground and pound that led to the end of this fight. Once again, here's our fight replay. We can see here in the clip, he's got the back mount, and he starts slamming home these brutal ground and pound strikes to end this contest. We can see it one more time from a different look. As soon as he's got the back mount in, this is the combination that he lands that ends this contest. And let's see that from another angle. With the official decision, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Arasaki is going to stop in this contest at 2 minutes, 52 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by TKO, Eddie Alvarez. Eddie Alvarez, victorious by TKO.